Why'd you always have to be so cute? <laughs> you look like a rabbit. Yeah, you look like a rabbit. So here I am again, um, playing Red Dead Redemption. Uh, I've been up like super early to say that I didn't have to be, and um, I feel better about being up early. I think I got up a little bit after Corolla went to work this morning. So um, yeah, currently playing uh, another episode of Red Dead Redemption, and there's a, a cat on the floor being all cute and everything, trying to get my attention. Yes, you are. I know you are. I know you are. And, uh, you know what I keep saying? I keep thinking that I've almost completed the game or something like this, and, um... Uh, and then, whenever... It, it, at first it was like, kill this guy. Alright then, so I've got to hunt this guy. That, that was the moral of the game. So anyway, so I hunted that guy down, and then it turned out that he had a friend, so I had to go hunt him down before I hunted the other guy down. And, um... And then, so I hunted that guy down, and then, um... <laughs> and then I got the guy with the whole moral of the story, and then, um, there's more missions, there's more story. And I'm like, oh my god, how long is this game? I think I've been playing it a total of, I don't know, 35 hours or something like that so far. I bet when I play it again, you know, like, uh, after I've completed it, I bet it won't take me as long, you know. But either way, uh, for your money's worth, it's uh, a very good game. Uh, it's much, uh, you know, like, you got your Medal of Honor and your Call of Duty games and stuff like this. And, uh, you know, uh, what I hear a lot- oops, change hands. Oh, this was starting to ache. Uh, what I hear a lot of people uh, complaining about with these sort of games is that they're too, sh uh, they're too short. Um, and they could do with being a bit longer, really. But it's amazing, you know, like how long this one is, you know, is. And I like it when they're like this. Um, sometimes it gets annoying, but... Oh well. This is the one I'm talking about right here, Red Dead Redemption. I want to try and uh, complete this one because there's the zombie one which I really run really, really, really want to have a look at. And um, and then where's the other one? Uh, I haven't played that yet, but a lot of people said they were uh, a bit disappointed with it. Uh, I quite like that. I could get into it, but then this is one of my favorites of all time, Alan Wake. Uh, seriously, that is a really good story, and it's it's not a short game either. It's um, it's really cool, and uh, this uh, it's. It's a great story because the guy who, whose character it is is uh, he's a writer <laughs> in the game, and there's not really any violence in it as much. It's you're shooting shadows, figments of your own imagination. And I think I've told you this before. Either way, but there's the uh, downloadable. Uh, this it's not the sequel, but it's uh, the Xbox Live version. Uh, it's coming out very soon, and I'm going to download it as soon as I get it. Shoot the lock off that door. I'll tell you something, that has got to be a world record. Because um, I figured, uh, what I recently realized is whenever I'm working the late shift 2 till 10, and um, around, uh, you know, 1 o'clock, I used to think about, you know, getting ready to go to work. And uh, that would include, you know, going upstairs, doing the three S's in the bathroom, and, uh, you know, and coming out. And it would just about be half past one by the time I left, uh, you know, to go to work. Anyway, um, I went up a little bit earlier, and that's going to be a world record, 24 minutes. It has taken me to do the three S's, or, you know, to powder myself, to make myself smell and look pretty, even though I'm not pretty, but, you know. And, uh, it gives me, uh, almost 25 minutes to, uh, play a bit more Xbox. Yay! Well, time to go to work, guys. I'll see you in about eight hours. So, eight hours later. <laughs> wow. It's, uh, been a nice shift. Uh, some of it went very, very quick. Uh... Otherwise, it was just as hard as the rest of them. Although, I think um, I've got a bit more energy now with uh, me eating a lot more fruit. And uh, it's just weird. I, I just car carried on going and I kept going and kept going. My uh, Nothing seemed to hurt. I didn't feel tired or anything. It was like uh, 
my neck's starting to creak a bit, but other than that, I'm not really that tired and uh, I, I'm not exhausted. So there you go. If you're ever tired and you don't eat a single ounce of fruit, um, eat some. Say goodnight, Toby. Good night.